New Orleans authorities were still searching for two suspects early Monday after one person was shot dead and nine more were wounded on the world famous Bourbon Street in the French Quarter early Sunday. We just sitting around like we're doing now, man. Crowd in the middle of the street, crowd on the other side, crowd on this side. Next thing you know, groups over there shooting, groups over here shooting, and the people in the middle getting hit. Man, we running for dear life, man. It's sad, right, man. It's sad we out here for a good time. Witnesses say the gunfire sent people scrambling for cover. Once I heard it, man, I looked up and realized it was gunfire coming from each side. Man, I dove on the ground. When I dove on the ground, people were stepping on me, trying to save their own life. You know, I can't be mad at nobody. Don't nobody want to get shot, man. Authorities say two men apparently shot at each other, catching victims in the crossfire. This shooting appears to have stemmed from an argument between two males who are not from New Orleans who actually met each other in the 100 block of Bourbon Street. We believe they ran into each other in the street and an argument ensued at that time that stemmed from an argument that was already, uh, that they had already had from another place. 12 people were arrested on weapons charges over the weekend, including one of the wounded. None of them is a suspect in the mass shooting, which happened amid a heavy police presence. At the time, there were nearly 40 plus police officers in and around the area. It's hard to police against that, but we are going to find a way. And as I have said many, many times in this city, uh, you may not be able to police your way out of this problem alone because the police need help. New Orleans was packed with visitors in town for football and the long holiday weekend. Kind of, kind of pushing us away now. Like, it's pushing us away. It could happen anywhere. It can happen in Arlington. It can happen and that, where... In fact, it yeah. happened in Dallas. So. Yeah, it can happen anywhere. It's not going to stop us from coming back to New Orleans. All of the wounded are expected to survive. Sandy Kozell, The Associated Press.